plate. What is going on? We have the Coleman Classic One Burner Butane Stove. Here it is. Got the, uh, the locking mechanism right there. On, off. It doesn't require any matches. It's automatic with the uh, butane. All right, so here's your butane. This is going to be our fuel. I'm going to pop off the cap. Pop this open. I mentioned this is where they <clears throat> gonna put the bottle and this notch is gonna go in here okay once you have the uh this little arm down here you want to lock it in place just like so there pop it you might not be able to see it but there's a actual fire there so uh, we're ready to cook and it's supposed to fit a 10 inch skillet pop some ghee on here and meat so I really like that it has the uh, little um, bars going around it so it protects the uh, flame from, from the wind because it's kind of windy out here. And you definitely feel the heat. This is, uh, we have it on max. Let's put this on halfway. Oh, you hear it right away. You can see the bubbles. It's bubbling it up. You got the gear in there. Put this on a little higher just to really grill it there is starting to cook i mean this is super convenient you know you got a little little stove here one burner you know you don't need a lot of space it's cooking you see bars here that's what protects the, the flame all right you hear it now it's crackling for sure let's see what we got all right so we're getting some so we're definitely grilling here. You see, know, it's getting grilled, but not getting the sound. Yep, it's, it's ready. Put this on here. I want to throw some eggs on here. All right, so we got the tortilla. We're gonna put this on here. It's not gonna fit all of it because I already can tell it's gonna be a little bit too small for the skillet. But we're gonna try to get as much of it in there. Here's our plate. We got the meat. We got the tortilla. I had to cut up the tortilla just because it was taking too long, so I cut it up and, uh, and layered it. I got some eggs. I got some salsa. But the 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 drawbacks is that while I was cooking the uh, tortilla, the uh, meat got a little cold because it is a small skillet. Obviously, it's gonna take uh, longer to heat up multiple things. Uh, so I would say it's just something to keep in mind. Uh, probably I would recommend having a bigger skillet and that would be one. Uh, and number two, if you can get, if you really want things to be fresh, fresh and all kind of done at the same time, I would recommend having one that has two burners. That way you can have multiple things uh, warming up at the same time. If you don't mind having, you know, kind of reheating things as a, uh, as they're kind of done, uh, then this is fine. I mean, for a, for a quick, for a e super easy setup, uh, something you can take on the, on the road, go camping to go to the park. It's super simple. I mean, I really like it and that, for that case. Uh, it has its positives, it has its negatives. I mean, let's see. Yeah, I mean, it's really good. First impressions, I definitely feel like it's uh, super convenient to have. Uh, something you can take on the road. Uh, like I said, you can go camping, you don't have to end up eating boring food. Uh, super convenient, easy to, uh, easy to set up, easy to uh, cook on. You know, it's not like charcoal, obviously charcoal some places won't allow you to have charcoal in there. Size, portability, super easy. Um, you know, it's only a couple pounds, it's not, you know, it's not anything crazy big. Uh, I think it's gonna be perfect for somebody who's got like a couple, you know, a couple of people that are gonna be uh, eating uh, because if it's gonna be more than a couple of people, uh, they're gonna be uh, waiting around for the other people's food to be, uh, be uh, cooked up, you know, so that's the, uh, the thing about that, something that small is that it is gonna be limited uh, to how much food you can uh, heat up or cook up at, at once. You know, it's not like propane. I, I feel like propane is gonna be more uh, consistent, is, is more, um, you know, you can do more with it. For 20 bucks, you know, that's what I caught it, got it for. 20 bucks is, you know, it's not bad. I, I don't think you can beat it. It's better be, beats, you know, eating out uh, McDonald's and stuff on the road. So you can take this out at the, uh, at the park. You can take that out at the uh, rest stop, set it up cook up your food and you know, you know as long as you you know it's gonna be for a couple of people you should be good uh, I like it 
I like it. Initial thoughts, that's what it is. If you like the video, give the video a thumbs up. Choose this, thumbs up. There you go. More reviews coming your way. So if you have any uh, questions, leave it in the comments. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye. Bye. Bye.